My name is Annie Cooper and I will be taking you through my project Gender Flux. Gender Flux is a simulation that aims to explore trans and gender or queer identities and what it is like to go through a day as a high schooler with a variety of genders. This gender might match the birth gender of the character you have been assigned or it might be a different one. I created my simulation using Twine, which is a great tool for interactive storytelling. I will now you take you through a walkthrough of the simulation to show you what a typical scenario might look like. Uh, there is a lot of text as it is a narrative oriented simulation, so I'll be summarizing most of it. On the first screen you get to choose a fruit which will assign you with a gender. I chose to do it this way because I don't want the, the interactor to actually choose their gender, but I want them to be able to choose a different one the next time they go through the simulation. So if I choose pineapple, I am female in a male body, so I'm a male to female transgender person. So, wake up. Uh, depending on what you're assigned, you get a different option here. So, uh, in this case, as a 17 year old boy, identifying as a girl, I am going to shave and I'm going to wear a skirt and a shirt. As you can see, making choices affect the variables at the bottom of the page with our self expression and anxiety. As uh, what I'm doing matches what I feel, self-expression goes up, and if I make decisions that make me socially uncomfortable, my anxiety goes up. So let's go to the kitchen. Here I'm interacting with my father. Like the rest of the game is about interaction and conversations with people in which you can make different choices depending on what you want to say or do. So if I try to explain why I don't feel comfortable with my father, he will dismiss my feelings as just teenager being a teenager. Then I get to interact with a friend, then with a group of friends, and then as I go home, I get a different ending. And if I try again, I can decide to start with a different gender identity. For example, here, I am someone born in a female's body that identifies as a gender. And then I can, I get a different option here than before. And can make different choices and I get a slightly different ending. Uh, ultimately I would like it if I would move away for Twine if I was to move forward with this project and uh, do something that would show early choices in addition to showing what is going on right now. Uh, so this is like a composition of an ideal uh, UI for my project. 